everyone, my name is Albert and welcome back to another YHD Studios video. So in this video I'm going to show you how to resize absolutely anything. You can also consider this a simple follow-up to my SketchUp tutorial because SketchUp actually resizes things. Depends, it simply depends on which template are you using. So uh, let's just say you just made your model right here. Everything looks fine, but when you go and load it into MMD and simply all the errors, it's either too big or too small. Well, not like in this case, because I remember I had once a model that simply was ant sized compared to the stage. So let's, for reference, uh, load the model. Boom. And left and just make him sit. Now you tell me if you will sit in something like this. Well, we need to make it bigger and in order to make it bigger, I need to slow down a little. You need to go into PMX editor. So let's wait for it to open, which will take a million years. Uh, and just simply open up your model. Well, to resize absolutely anything that PMX can open, there are two ways. From what I know, and the simple two ways with no plugins or anything. Well, what? it's a plugin, but it's simply installed into PMX editor, or it just comes with the program. <coughs> so, what you want to do is simply press Ctrl A and select everything and make sure you have the V, which comes from Vertex, select that, and just simply go into Edit, Plugin, System, and Sign Change Tool. Well, this is one plugin that you simply use when you know that simple exact size, or you just know 4 or 4.4592, and yeah, all the others, and you get it right, but in this case, I did not get it right, and I'm simply gonna press Ctrl Z, and again, Ctrl A, or if they are small enough, just like this, Ctrl A, and on MOV, or Object Manipulation, where it says right here, scale, you can scale the object, like, you can make it extremely long, extremely thin, like, this is paper tin and yeah you can simply manipulate but in those cases I don't want to do that I just simply want to make it a little bit bigger so you're gonna press and hold down scale and make it bigger so where do you know or when do you know when it simply fits your model well you just look and you just one trial and error thing I know it's annoying but still this is one of the best method that's, methods that I could find. And I know it's annoying, but still better than just simply going with the wrong thing, with the plugin, because yeah, like this is much better, especially if your computer is extremely fast and just simply save or no, export because this is the dot, uh, .x file. Save, yes, replace, yes, thank you. And right now you just simply go ahead, open it, and the X file, and see if it fits your model. Like I said, this is a trial and error thing, which just sucks, by the way. And simply gotta try it till you succeed. So, I'm gonna speed everything up or not because this works apparently. So uh, I think that's the right foot. And yeah, that's kind of how you export things or actually you resize things from SketchUp or anything that PMX can open simply it have you can even resize models stages everything that can be open in PMX editor 
So yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this video and if you did smash the like button and if I helped you, well, thank you, something, anything. And yeah, if you want to make me happy, press the subscribe button, it's free and it's not illegal and it's simply good, a good thing to do. Anyway, so I was Albert from Hindi Studios, thank you for watching, bye!